Hey everyone, I just want to let you know I upgraded my Thunderbolt. That's right, I'm still rocking the Thunderbolt. Well, the good news is for anybody who has decided not to buy a new phone right now, you can actually get a lot more life out of this. I was running Shift CNC on this, which is like uh, since 2.6, 2.8, something like that. Um, I'm now running 4.04, .04, a lot like Jelly Bean, not Jelly Bean, but a lot like Jelly Bean. Um, these are all customizable down at the bottom. You've got a kind of a, you can't see it very well here, but you've got kind of a cool graphic for rotating through your screens. You don't go to one side and stop. It actually does a full rotisserie. So if you go all the way to one end of your fifth, of your five screens, um, it just continues on. Also, I found that the pull-down menu gives you a lot more information, missed calls, all this, and a, a nice movable piece here. There is a, this is a, a rooted phone, and... The version I got is from Infected ROM. I'll provide that address in the in the notes. Um, you could go ahead and go with the bloated version directly from Verizon. I just don't like that. You know, uh, back up your stuff first. I really recommend it. Can't recommend enough. You know, if you choose to do this and you blunder, unfortunately, that's on you. But if you do it right, it's really hard to break your phone. Not impossible, just hard. Um, when you back up, like I used my backup pro, I actually paid for it. Uh, titanium works really well too. Back up your stuff and then also back up your data settings. Trust me, you're going to thank yourself. I found I had to import my contacts separately and then it wigged out. Too many contacts. So put in, if you've got multiple email addresses like I do, I've got like six, only bring in one, set it up, bring your contacts in and delete your unknowns. And if you've done this before, you'll know what I'm talking about. If you don't, you'll discover it. It takes about 45 minutes for the install to happen. Clear three hours, because you're going to be tinkering. Now, on the infected ROM site, you're going to find, you can get the bloated or non-bloated. They actually take the, the you know, install your, your radio first, follow the instructions. Do not, not follow these guys' instructions. Do follow their instructions. Yes. All right. Now, um, I use the ODX version because I use the DODX version, and I found that I had all kinds of problems. So, if you're gonna do this, I recommend the ODX version. Also, you will notice this: there is some hesitation. It it does have some some uh, issues, and not even issues. It's just a little bit hesitant, but it's only a single processor. Now let me move this out of the way. This is the, the page right here and infected ROMs. And I'm going to give you guys the website included, but like here is the one I used. I used the ODX version. And I used the Deep Loaded because I just don't like all the gear. I, I, I'm, I'm not as big into it. Up here, he's got a link to the radios. And, you know, this guy rocks. These guys rock. So if you can, donate. If you can't, well, that's what they're here for. It's all hobby type stuff. It's just nice to be appreciated. Um, I would say if you're a tinker and you want to extend the life of your phone, this is a good move. I'm pretty happy I did it. Like all upgrades, about midway through, I was less happy I did it. And then finally things kind of kind of check out. Now it, it did behave slowly at first, but I think after I started removing things that didn't work and putting things that back on, it's back up to normal speed. But there is a little bit of hesitation over to shift C and C. Now granted I had beefed up the kernel on that one. But for a single for a phone that actually all in all wasn't a bad design, just had a lot of bugs to start off with. Uh, if you can extend this another couple years or another year I think that this is a good move, and that's why we have rooted phones, so that we can extend the life of our phones. Um, any questions, let me know, and uh, I'll do whatever I can, and if need be, I'll put in our video up of something specific if anybody's got a, a direct answer. Um, spoiler alert, I'm going to be doing probably very soon some, uh, well, I'm going to try to do some training, excuse me, some training stuff on Homer and show you guys what I've been working on there. Um, all right, Rob.